Hey everybody, it's Coach. And Mrs. Coach. And uh, Ms. Coach is sitting here talking about what we have to cut out. Uh, we, we would have an amazing blooper reel if I kept them all, probably. Mm-hmm. Uh, in any case, this is Coach Cast TV. Yes. And uh, welcome to our queenies and everybody else uh, that uh, is tuning into this one today. Mm-hmm. Uh, we have been told uh, that the next one that we should do, well, we've been told the next one we should do is Live Aid. And uh, we will get to that. And we will get to that. We've been traveling some. Yes. And so we uh, haven't had time to film that one yet. And uh, we're just getting a few of these in in the evenings after work until we can get to the weekend. Yes. Uh, when we hope to be able to maybe work on that one yes. this weekend. Are you going to tell them why we were traveling? Uh, Coach Junior may or may not uh, have a Mrs. Coach Jr. now. He does. Uh, I think we were there for it. Yes. So uh, that's why we were traveling. Mm-hmm. And uh, so congratulations are in order to Coach Jr. and the Mrs. Jr. What are we going to name Jr. her now? What are we going to name her? I'm thinking Coach Ed. Because uh, she's a little coach. She's a little m- coach. Mrs. 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 Cochet? I'd like that. Mrs. Junior. Okay. Whatever. Hey, guys, why don't you help us give her a name? So put it in the comment section. Yeah. Anyway, uh, we were told this probably is going to be your speed mm-hmm. of song. It is called White Queen. Yes, I and read that. It is a note, a night, a note, a night. <sighs> it's going to be one of those nights. Uh, it's a night at the Odeon, Hammersmith, 1975. Mm-hmm. You got tongue tied uh, a You bit. ready to go? I am ready to go. Then let's do it. Let's do it. All right, you ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's go. So sad, all right. Smiling dark eyes, so sad her eyes, as if the end of On such a my brow, the light is kiss, I walk to Lord. All around the air is safe, my lady soon will stir this way, in sorrow no What you think? I like it. It's it's a different side of them. It um, is. They're, you know, Queen is not one of the groups that is um, what I would call systematic in that all their stuff sounds similar. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, there's a lot of variety yes. uh, in the sound of Queen, and this is a. a I think this is different. Uh, than anything else that we've heard mm-hmm. from them. So well, far. it's it's strange to see them with the long hair, but it was in the seventies. Yeah, Freddie. Freddie I mean, looks. Just, I prefer. I like with Freddie the other, with the shorter hair. Yeah, yeah. the other haircut. Uh, mm-hmm. And you know, one thing too that I just wanted to point out really quickly uh, for our Queen fans, uh, we know that you guys are very passionate about this band yes. and uh, about their music. And I think that it's important to note that. You know, they have a huge catalog. And mm-hmm. if we keep doing Queen Reactions, and we certainly intend to, 
uh, we are probably eventually going to find a song that we just really don't care for that much. Well, and and unlike a lot of other channels, we're not going to sit here and pretend we like it if we don't like it. Mm-hmm. And that doesn't mean that we don't like Queen, mm-hmm. and it doesn't mean uh, any disrespect to the band members. It simply means that that particular piece of art didn't hit a chord. Didn't with us. didn't appeal to us. Yes, and it's very possible that she'll like something I won't, and vice versa, mm-hmm. because musically we're pretty much polar opposites. Yep, mm, we are, and we can still get along. <laughs> And sometimes, most sometimes. of the time. <laughs> and, uh, you know, we can still get along with you guys. If, yeah. it, if there comes a day when we don't like one of these songs, mm-hmm. uh, we can still get along. Yeah. And uh, I just wanted to say that because with a huge catalog and the diverse sound yeah. that they have, uh, I'm confident we'll run across one at some point one of us won't like. Well, I mean, I'll be honest with you. This one right here. It's it's way different from the ones that we've already reacted to. Yeah. The you know the outfits, the the hair, the music. We're used to what we've reacted to has been really upbeat and going. The Queen fans, the Queenies, they actually got this right. I really like it. I like the melody. I love just the the low beat. It's just one of those. Those songs that you could really just lose yourself the, in. The jury is yeah. still out for coach okay. on this one. I'm just going to be honest right now, but we'll see. Okay. How did the fair would have you seen the mother of the willow queen? I call the name. Have I stayed? I love the footsteps that she made And when she came Don't shoot me. I don't know where to pause in this one. I don't know if this continues to the yeah. end or not. I know you're not supposed to interrupt the instrumental solos, uh, but we also have to pause at, at places yeah. throughout. So just don't shoot me in the comments. But you you can see that this shows his classical diversity with him playing the yeah. piano and the guitars in the background. I mean, this is a side that, you really didn't know Queen had to a degree because all I've heard is what we've reacted to and what was what you heard, you know, when we were younger on the radio. This one, if I'm being honest, started out with me kind of on the fence and, and not really caring for mm-hmm. it. And then when it went to the instrumental, 
uh, I, I can dig it now. Yeah. And uh, I'm, I'm enjoying this. And like I said, guys, if you've never heard a song, you don't really know when to pause. Yes. So uh, just keep that in mind if I but happen to pause at the wrong time. Please tell me if I'm wrong. The Queen, the Queenies told us that each member of this band plays at least two instruments. Yeah. I, as far yeah. as I remember, yes. Yeah. That's so correct. it's amazing to watch him play the piano. Yeah. I mean, it is because well, he was way above his time. Yeah, let's uh, finish okay. this off here. Microphone. I guess that was from the start with Queen. Yeah, they they, yeah. they told us that that happened okay. a, a long time prior to that. Yeah. Uh, well, they said that you would probably like that more. I did. I really did. I loved the words at the beginning were really sweet, but honestly, what really intrigued me was the was the instrumental through that whole thing. You could actually see he was really just passionate about what he was playing and the guys in the the drums and the guitars i mean they are just like i've said before a complete package i really wish when i was younger i would have taken the time to listen to them because i think um, i really would have liked them when i was younger so first of all uh very interesting fashion choice uh, oh, for yes, Freddie and Brian there in particular in that. Uh, and I do think that Brian uh, sounded fantastic on the guitar there. The and it really went well with the piano. Mm -hmm. And I know that in some of the comments, uh, people had said that we would enjoy the yeah. uh, back and forth, really, of the piano and the guitar. And that, that was good. To me, that was the best part mm -hmm. of the song. Um, so uh, I don't think uh, that this is the best Queen song that we've ever listened to, but I do think that it's a solid song now that I've gotten all the way through it. Well, it's it's a it's a totally different, it's a different genre, right? Than it's what different. we're what we've reacted to. They were upbeat and the drums and all that right there. This <clears throat> is more the mellow side of him, and I mean, honestly speaking, 1975, he was way above his time. Yeah. Because, so. you know, I mean, even in his dressing and the way he carried himself, he's just, the, the whole band is just cohesively probably one of the best groups I can say that I've ever seen play together on a stage. Yeah, even uh, some of the people that I work with on a daily basis who are also subscribed to this channel, uh, they have mentioned... Uh, that they were uh, kind of impressed, really, by this group because they didn't realize that they were so good live. Mm -hmm. And uh, I do think that this group shines live. I know that we've had some comments in our comment section that um, we shouldn't say that, that um, I forget exactly how the one comment went, but that, you know, in studio they could really make it perfect and that they cut corners sometimes on the live vocals and different things. And, and it may be true that the live is not 100% what the studio was. But I think that's the beauty of live It music. shows them truly on stage with themselves. And it gives them, it gives you the appreciation for the talent 
that they have while playing this. Yeah, well, I'm always going to prefer yeah. live because I just like live music better. But I can appreciate the fact that some people prefer studio. Mm-hmm. You know, more. some songs are better studio, and well, some bands are better yes. studio mm-hmm. because they're just not that good live. But yep, this, because you this have all the electronics. Really Anyway, I think we've said all that can be said yeah. for this one, and uh, it was it was a good one, and uh, we certainly are going to work on Live Aid soon, yeah. uh, but keep giving us, uh, you know, things that you think we'd want to hear. Uh, I think there's, I've seen everybody say from two to three hundred in their catalog. Uh, does anybody know the actual count, how many songs there are? And then I guess there's studio and live, and then... People have said, well, if you do this live, it's different than the other live. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So uh, we could be doing Queen until we're on Social Security or, or later. But you know what? Queen is just such a diverse band. It doesn't matter whether they're live or studio. Either one, it seems to what we've been told, they just shine no matter what. And for the for the viewer who recommended this... Mrs. Coach says, thank you very much. I loved it. Well, it was multiple it. views. Okay. Quite well, a few I loved views. it. Thank you. Uh, all right, guys. Well, that's all for today. Uh, if you would, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. And ring that bell. And we will see you next time on CoachCast TV.